Hello, my name is Gina James. I'm 41 years old. I'm a wife and I'm a mother of nine. Um, relationships. I've been married for six years. Me and my husband have been together for seven. Um, we definitely have had our ups and downs. We've been through it all with infidelity, um, cheating, lying, um, you name it, you know, we've been through it. But the one thing that we realized that our marriage, our children, our family was more important than these outside people and these outside things. Everybody makes mistakes, but it takes two to work it out. And I love, would love to keep a diary, not just to help others, but for ourselves, you know, so that we can look back on and see the things that mistakes that we've made and also how we've grown from them. In order for you to move forward and everything, you have to reflect on the past and you have to change that and you have to do something about it. But overall, if you can't be honest with your mate, with your spouse, with your friend, it's not going to work out. You know, no matter what you do, no matter how you do it. If you're not honest with that person that you're planning on spending the rest of your life with or even today, if you're not focusing on today, it will never work, you know. Um, my husband cheated on me and I had to come to that point that men are going to be men. They're going to do whatever it is that they want to do. But if he's honest with you about what he's doing, if he's sincere about his apology and not doing it again, you can work it out. You can make it work out. Um, I'm honest about everything. If I go out and I go out on the town with the girls and ha I have fun, the first thing I'm doing when I come home, when my husband said, what did you do? Did you dance? Did you meet someone? I'm saying, yeah, I did. I met somebody. I danced. I enjoyed myself. Oh, he bought me a few drinks. But at the end of the night, I brought my ass home. That's being honest. That's letting him know he ain't got to pick up your phone. He don't have to check up on you. He don't have to do this and that. Ladies, you don't have to go in his pockets. You don't have to go through his voicemails, his emails, and all of that. Because if he's doing something and you ask if he loves you, he's going to be honest with you. If he's lying and he's lying to you once and then you catch him and he lies to you twice and you catch